Thanks, Nicole. Athens City Schools just wrapped up its first day of school. Kids returned to the classroom today under a mask requirement. Not everyone agrees with that policy. Way 31's Alex Torres Perez learned what parents had to say. I was robbed of a whole year and you're wanting to take away another? Some Athens City School parents were not happy with the board's decision to make masking a requirement this school year. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. The parents say they wish the board would have asked the parents to vote on the mask mandate. The majority who showed up to Monday's school board meeting said they did not want to make masking a requirement, but the majority in the room are not necessarily the majority of the people in the city of Athens. Dr. Wayne Reynolds is with the State Board of Education. He represents the area of Limestone County. He says he understands parents' frustration. Everything that local boards or state boards do doesn't please everyone, but we have to make decisions on the, what we think is the best interest of the total population. Some parents voiced they would sign a waiver. I would sign one not to hold them liable. We wanted the choice. That's all we wanted was uh, was an option. But Dr. Reynolds says that's not something they can do. If you waive one child, you don't say they don't affect the health of others. And the concept of masking is for the ma for the effect on massive numbers of people, not just the one child involved in that decision. Alex Torres Perez, Way 31 News. At this time, it's unclear how long the mask mandate will remain in effect at Athens City Schools, but the district superintendent said her goal is to return to making masking optional once COVID numbers improve in the area.